Hi, I'm Whitney, and together with my husband Cameron, we have done something huge. Lady Hawk has been sitting on land in this very spot for nearly two decades. Two years ago, we took over Whitney's dad's project because why not? Who doesn't want a massive boat project? We tore her apart way more than we ever thought we would, and we brought her back to life. This is our gateway to the Salish Sea, showing our young kids what life is like on the water. It's taken blood, sweat, tears, and a village to get here. Both of our dads put hours in, hours of teak work by Cameron's mom and brother, so many hours of free childcare by Whitney's mom and sister, friends that stopped by to see the project that we just put to work. Today is a special day. Lady Hawk feels the water under her keel once again. For the first time in 18-ish years, a truly monumentous day that we seriously can't wait to share. Now, let the excitement begin. All right, what are we doing today? Going to the boat. What are we to launch it. And, and see things around the boat. In the water. In the water. It's launch day. Okay, there are three major milestones we need to hit to get Lady Hawk from this tent to the water. One, get her on the trailer. Two, get her out the driveway. And three, put her in the water and hope for no leaks. What you can't see in this video is the amount of stress we endured this day. Maybe it was just me, but I think everybody was feeling it by this point. With that being said, the one thing that did not stress me out this day was our driver. He was so great at problem solving, figuring this out, really, really professional. So close to being on the trailer, it's crazy. That looks like commitment to me. I'm in my nice clothes, laying in the dirt. You're good. Oh, dog, diggity dog. Yeah, like two, two feet. It looks way closer than that. Yeah. Okay, you're clear of the house. What the? What? Where's the boat? Oh, that's so weird. I've like visualized this in my head for so long that now it feels kind of like an out-of-body experience. Like, I don't know, this is crazy. We're watching Lady Hawk go out the driveway.
All right, so who is worried about the driveway? Not me. We can just go to the port and we don't have to sit here and go like this the whole way down to the port. We can just go to the port and then meet us there. I, I want to watch. You want to follow it. <laughs> We're following Lady Hawk. Oh boy. Ooh, out-of-body experience right now uh, just seeing the boat going down the road it, it's very odd and the fact that we don't have to go back to the tent anymore like I don't even know dad could do whatever he wants with his tent and I don't know that I'd ever know because I don't have to go in there anymore Oh, she's floating! Yeah, they're grabbing. 
been hooked. And as it goes in boat yards, you can't stay long. Sometimes you just have to take a leap of faith, get going. To our slip we go, let this adventure begin. Me. Yeah? Yeah, and you're going to come too. Okay. Yeah, you and I'm going to come. And I'm going that in the big boat. Yeah? Where's this boat going? What? Where's the boat gonna go? Uh, to park. To the park? Yeah. There will be a wheel on it. Yeah? Yeah, wheel, big wheel on it. Big wheels on it? Yeah. Really? Yeah. Whoa. Are boats ever really done? Let me know, because there's still a lot of work to do on Lady Hawk, and we can't wait to share that with you on the water.